Hello everyone, my name is K.M. Wyland, and today I'm going to show you how to do some important tasks in my um, novel planning software, Outlining Your Novel Workbook, which is based on my books of the same name. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is just how to create a new file, which of course is something really simple, but it's a little different in our program than it is in a lot of word processors. So I just want to go over that really quick in case you're having any questions about that. So how we do that is we go up here to this button, which is the logo button, which we call the control button. And if you click on that, you find all kinds of interesting and important little features, not least of which is how to create a new file. So really simple. All you have to do is find this little plus button under the word add and click on that. And that's going to give you the opportunity to type in a new project name. I'm going to type in the name of my su historical superhero work in progress Wayfair. And then you just punch save. It immediately goes to the new um, file. And then if you want to access a previous file that you've already saved, you go back up to the control button and open your control box here. And then you're going to have this drop down menu that's going to display the name of the program or the name of the file you're in to begin with. But if you want to switch to a different uh, project, all you have to do is click the arrow and it'll take you to a full list of everything that you've already saved. So at this point all we have is the one I just created, Wayfair, and the demo project which comes with the program and kind of just walks you through all of the different features. So it's a really great thing to go through in the beginning when you're trying to figure out, you know, all the program is capable of. So the other thing that we need to talk about really quick is how to save your file. So you're in your book that you're outlined that you're creating and you've made changes. You want to make sure that it's saved, but there's no save button, right? That's because the program automatically saves everything you do. So at this point, if you were to completely cancel out of the program, you don't need to hit a save button. It's automatically saved and the program will remember it when you come back. So you don't need to worry about save buttons at all, which I think is like a super handy feature because I'm always forgetting to save and losing things when the power goes out or something. So to create a new project, go up to control button, click the add button, to access a previously saved project, you go to this drop-down menu, choose, and you don't have to worry about saving it. And that's it.